my channel. It's very loud here. Should I be doing an introduction? Probably not, but we're gonna give it a shot anyway. Uh, today is day one of my first week in Houston. I am here for the huge Round Top Antique and Interior Decorator Show. And I am waiting to be picked up by Christy from Tippy Winks Vintage. Uh, she is a wonderful friend of mine and I'm so excited to be able to see her and give her a hug in person. So just waiting with my bags. I feel like I packed my entire house with me, but hopefully there's room at her house for all my bags. <laughs> and I was like, that's her, that's her. It's like, thank God. Were you waiting a very long time? No, I wasn't waiting too long. Guess what you guys, Christy found me. I found her. <laughs> I found her. <laughs> so now, I know you were thinking about taking me to an antique mall. Is that still the plan? That's still the plan. We're going to antique mall. And what's the name of the antique mall? Spring Antique Mall. Spring Antique Mall. So, I don't have my feet on Houston soil longer than 30 minutes, and I'm already being taken to an antique mall. Antique mall. So the trip is looking good. Looking good. <laughs> what do you what do you think, Tippy? He says this is just power for the course. This is just power. He loves to be on the road. Loves it. Look at all the pretty trees. And let's see. So we've already made a detour. Christy has decided to take me to downtown Spring. Old Town Spring. Old Town Spring. And show me some of the cute little shops here on this main street. Yay! So first we're going to look at a Sears and Roebuck um, catalog house. Yeah, it was a Sears and Roebuck catalog house. And you could, and so they, they ordered it and had it put up. And then they said, supposedly, the woman, somebody who was uh, like a founder here, she walked in and she looked around and said no and headed back to up north. It's adorable. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love it in here. And everything in here is really cool. I mean, just, the, and the people that, that run it, they decorate it so well. So you're gonna have a great time in here. It smells so amazing in here. Look at the little snowman dolls. So this is like the front parlor of the house. Mm -hmm. It's adorable. I'm gonna back out because then you can see it. Very the cute. Away, but they, they still run this. I like these little dolls. They're little snowmen, fifty-one dollars. <gasps> Look at him. He's cute. Is it made out of fabric? It's, it's fabric. Joe Spencer's Gathered Traditions. Oh, I was just looking at this tag at my flea market. They were um, box head uh, little sitting dolls. They, oh. The heads were made from little boxes. That's interesting. It's the same wholesaler. But these are freaking cute. They're adorable. I'm getting into the Christmas spirit in this store. Oh my God, look. It's a nutcracker of the dad with the leg lamp from the Christmas story. Huh? That's pretty funny. Yeah. It's very quaint. Lots of charm. Is this an octopus? Yep. It's an octopus. It's an octopus? Yeah. Hmm. I have some great floral stems. I love this. Look at the color of this poinsettia. I don't know if it's coming off on camera, but this is kind of like a really soft tan color. It's actually super pretty. Look at this. Oh my God. Oh my God. That is the cutest kitchen. That kitchen. is, you know, the kitsch is really permeating the uh, current retail market, I am noticing, 396. Uh, it seems like more and more of the retro kitsch uh, is starting to be remade and sold, you know, with new retail. Now that's different. I don't think, 
I don't think uh, Target would have this. No. Let's see. Oh, this again, this is a Joe Spencer's. Same kind of guy. Okay, so we made it to Camille's. This is the vintage boutique that Christy loves to go to here in I love Spring. To go to it. Where what is it called again? Oh, Old Town Spring. Old Town Spring. That's where we are. We have a really pretty little gilded section. I just got a box like this at Springfield. This one's 28. And the little dish is $30. And this is a really pretty garland, just going up a, a wireframe topiary armature. And I like how they added all of the uh, feathers on it. Of course, I love it because it's in tones of brown and bronze and copper. Really cute. And look at all the vintage clothes. Wow. Look at the teeny tiny waist on this vintage 1950s prom dress oh wow these are wonderful vintage dresses let's see this little one is sixty dollars this one's 45 and she's even got a section for coats with the hat boxes on at the top. You almost feel like you could be traveling back into time at a 1950s department store. Very cute. All right, we are now at the Spring Antique Mall that Christy wanted to take me to. This is her favorite antique mall to shop in. It looks like there are a lot of booths in here. So of course we have to check out Christy's favorite booth. And I see that they already have teddy bears. I love the brown color on this guy. This is a Stif. He's $75. I think so. Yeah. Let's see. Is he a West Germany tag? Uh, this just is made in Germany. So this one might be uh, fairly new. This little guy. This one says made in West Germany, so this one's a little bit older. How much is the littler guy? He is $79. But they just have such a great, great look. Oh. And then this is a different, a different design style made by Stife. I forget what this one is called. This is 70, $70. Oh, I like that they have all the holidays out year round. They've got a full Easter bookshelf still. That's cool. And then over here, they've got some Halloween out. Look at this. <gasps> Oh, how cute. Oh, probably what, 60s maybe? But how fun for a Halloween decor item that is uh, not your typical $50. Cute. Oh, I haven't seen this toy. Look at this one. A lot of the um, tin lithograph graphic is uh, rusted out. But it's still very original. Oh, it's only $18. Look at that. With the devil. Ah. Oh, I wonder how common this one is. It seems like a good price. 
I mean, it still has the witch. You can still see her. Uh, the booth has Wedgwood, so of course I have given it my stamp of approval, and I love this little fluted, urn-shaped bud vase. It is thirty-five. It's thirty-five dollars, but I don't come across this one very much. I I think it's beautiful, so I'm already tempted. First booth in, and I am tempted. We've got a fun little desk area, paperweight. This is of maybe a German castle, possibly. $12. That's really cute. They've got, look at all the desk things. Got a receipt spike, a nice tall one. That's 22. That's a big one. What did you find? Oh. Is that a biscuit? What does that say? Crackers. Oh, it's a cracker. Oh, is, did you look at this last year? Yeah. I remember. Yeah. Let's see. How much? Let's show everybody. It's 30% off. 30% off $40. Oh, man. We're tempted, aren't we? Yes, we are. <laughs> we are. Look at this. Great, look at all the great silver paper. Oh, yeah. Really good. Really good. Oh, look at look at the feet on this. Oh, take it out. Take it out. It wants to see the light of Isn't day. But look, look at the faces. It's like a little German. It looks like Edwardian. I don't know. It's to me it looks like a little German man because he's got the mustache mm -hmm. and the helmet kind of looking guy. But do you think it's Edwardian or do you think it's like I think it's older. I think it's Victorian. Hold on, I have no place. Hold it? I just wanted to see price. 40, wow. Yeah, no, I still think that's. It's the set though, I think. I think that's Victorian. It's the set, it's that and this. Oh, uh, okay. That's very cool. I'm gonna destroy everything. That's all right. No. The one good thing about silver plate is it's, I mean, it's not indestructible, but it can take, yeah, a few knocks. Okay, so Christy brought me to her other favorite booth, and I can see why. Look at the little Victorian jacket all the way up at the top up there. We're going to have to take a deeper look. Look at the teeny tiny dress. Wow. Oh, wow. Buttons, Shoe lace clips. trims. Shoe clips. Shoe clips. This is the best booth in the world. Look at that. 25. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even the doll is gorgeous. Look it, a little half doll who's not so little. And she's only $12. Do you want to come home with me? Yes, I do. <laughs> she loves me. She wants to come home with me. I've got some beautiful Culver glasses, a set of eight for 85. I am very, of course, drawn to the large jar. It's only 24. This is only $24. Look at the lid for the lid alone. It's beautiful. Um, oh, gosh. Why did she bring me here? Ugh, Christy, look at this. Look at the lid. It's only $24. That's really good. But it's really heavy. I think it'd be too heavy to take in a suitcase. No, it's not. Yeah, it kind of is. But the lid is great, isn't it? It's great. Good. I love it. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. So no? I don't, I don't think so. Oh, look at. Look at the chocolate oh, chocolate pot chocolate with the pot. two 
$65. Oh, and it's brown. I need a <laughs> But it's so darling. But if you have that really concentrated, yummy hot chocolate, this, this, <laughs> I think it'd be the perfect size. Oh, it's gorgeous. I love it. That is so pretty. <sighs> I forgot you were even here, Tippy. <laughs> Super comfy. Oh my gosh. You're just hanging out, literally. <laughs> That's hysterical. <laughs> Should I take this home to Scott? 